Hello everyone, it's Ursula Gontier from the Cochrane Community Support Team. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to use the spell check feature in Revman Web. When you open your review in Revman Web, in either the default or the full text view, the spell check is automatically enabled. You can choose to disable it for the duration of an editing session. It will be re-enabled the next time you open the review. You can also choose which language you would like to use to correct your review by toggling between language choices here. Check with your review group in case they have a preference for spelling. I've selected British English for this review. The online spell checker will automatically underline any words which it doesn't recognise in its dictionary. To add a commonly used word to your dictionary, right click and choose add word. You can also choose to ignore a word if you do not want any further instances to be flagged as errors for the duration of your editing session. If you're correcting a misspelled word, the spell checker will suggest relevant replacements. If you're trying to correct a word which is not misspelled, but where spelling is inconsistent within the review itself, for instance in the choice of IS or IZ spelling of common terms such as randomised, you can use a find and replace extension in your browser to search for and alter relevant terms. You can choose to replace one or all instances of a misspelled word. Don't forget that the Cochrane Style Manual is available via a direct link on the Revman Web Help menu and provides useful advice on spelling and formatting of common terms and terminology. Always proofread and correct your review before submitting for editorial approval to ensure that your review moves smoothly towards publication. If you have any questions about Revman Web, contact the Cochrane Community Support Team by emailing support at cochrane.org and we'll be happy to help. Thank you.